So the first thing we have to do when we're working with pure data is get it installed onto our machine. Now whether you're using a Windows machine or whether you're using a Mac, you still have to go to the pure data website. And the version of pure data that we're looking for is pure data extended. The reason why we go for extended is because it's got a lot of extra libraries uh, to do with managing video and a few other different things that we're interested in. So we'll always download Pure Data Extended. So let's go to the uh, download section of the Pure Data website and Pure Data Extended. And what's key when we're looking at the Pure Data Extended is to pick the right version for the computer that we're working on. So the computers in the lab 403, they are all Mac OS 10, and they're all running on an Intel processor. So that's the type of that's the type of PD extended that we're going to download. But if you're working on a Windows machine, the choice is a lot easier because just one download will service all different Windows machines. So for this machine, this is a Mac, so I'm going to get PD extended for Mac OS, the Intel version. So I will just click and download that. And so that's going to download. It's about a 40 meg download. So it'll just take a few minutes. And once the download is complete, we can just open the downloads folder in uh, our finder if it doesn't do so already or it doesn't do so automatically and just find the download the DMG file just double click on that and it will install itself and the last step that we have to do is we just have to drag this icon here in the window that crops up and we drop it into the applications folder and the pure data application should now be in our applications folder and we should be able to click on the applications folder in our dock find pure data click on it and that should really be it Downloading and installing Pure Data on a Windows machine is just as straightforward. Just follow the instructions and uh, start up your Pure Data and you're ready to go.